Bro, you guys want to hear some fried shit? So me and Andrea wake up in a crazy rush this morning and we're like, oh my God, we're going to be late. We have a dentist appointment. It, it's already, it's 8.30, the appointment's at 9, it's 50 minutes away, we're getting ready, we're putting clothes on. I, I'm just in like whatever. Literally, and, and she, a just, she at, take, like, just threw on whatever. We're, we're driving over to the appointment and then, and I'm like, dude, you gotta call them, you gotta call them, we're late. And she's on the phone with them and they're like, oh, we have to verify your appointment. And she's like, verify the appointment. Like y'all literally sent me a text this morning that said like, hey, confirm your appointment. And then uh, they go. And they're like, yeah, we don't see an appointment for you today. And it's because the appointment is tomorrow. So we live in downtown LA and the appointment is in Beverly Hills. And if you don't know, that's like an hour away with traffic right now, yeah. in the morning. We just drove an hour out basically for nothing. So now we're stuck in Beverly Hills for a couple hours because we need to let the traffic die down. So let's go on an adventure. responsibility I really do we should be double checking with each other but I I'm really the double checker but I yesterday at 9 in the morning it said like remember you have an appointment and it said come reply one to confirm so I'm thinking they sent it a day before but no the it, they did it does say Thursday May 23rd I have no notion of time space reality it is what it is. Let's make a day out of this. Bro, we're fried. The thing I hate about LA is, bro, there is no escaping the traffic because right now I try to cut through like one of the little side streets. You guys see it's like apartments, it's houses, and there's still traffic, bro. Like there's no way out of it. But the move is basically that we found a cafe that's in Century City Mall, which is literally one of the most beautiful malls out here in LA. Great vibes, great energy. And we're gonna go get some chicken shawarma and eggs Florentine Benedict. Big boom, and I'll show you guys. Yeah, I'll show you guys around the mall. Yeah, that's really it. Bro, we're at the mall so early. They're just bumping Joji. Nothing is open. And we're like literally the only human. This is like a liminal space. Shout out to Adam. Maybe in the end, all we needed was just a good little breakfast together. That's true. That's Things true. happen for a reason. That's true. Maybe the house would have burned down if we stayed at the house this morning. I rebuke that. Maybe there's going to be an earthquake. But if we were inside of our building, something would have happened to us. Maybe we're going to run in to Tom Brady and I get a fit check. Maybe. I hope Tom Brady don't have no controversies. Maybe I'm going to find a $100 bill on the floor. Maybe something about being in this energetic frequency is going to attract exactly what I'm trying to manifest and need. Maybe it's because Jupiter is aligned with Venus right now. So that meant that we had to come a day early. Yes, but <laughs> do you know this means we have to come back tomorrow? Okay guys, we have something that we need to say. So he was like, do you guys need hot sauce? And I was like, yes, but also, was he racially profiling? Do they ask the white people, do you need hot sauce? Or is it only because we're... Is it because is it we are speaking Spanish and put our... Some burritos? Is that it? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, this looks really good. Thank you, thank you. All right, y'all, we just... Oh, my hair is all over the place. All right, y'all, we just left food. And tell me why we're on Melrose now, you know, the poppin' street in LA. And we just saw Soldier Boy across the street. Is that Mr. Boy? I swear it was Soldier Boy, bro. I think it's him, but I, I think it's him. I'm gonna go get the fit check. I, I don't care. It's fit check time. What's up, bro? What's up? Hey, I'm Jared. Nice to meet you. Hey, let me get a fit check with you, bro. Let's do it. Oh, yup. Yeah. What's up, bro? What's up? What's good, what's good, what's How good. you doing? I'm good. Hello. How you doing? It's good, how are you? Good. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, this is my page. I just did like cheap keep and shit. Cheap key, Mexican OT, all that. Dope, dope. Run it. Fuck yeah. Can I use your phone? Like, is that right here? What'd you say? A photo? A uh, fit check. Oh, fit check? Yeah, right, fit check. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you said a photo. My bad. Nah, nah, nah. I'll get it. Let's do it. Hell yeah. yeah fit right? check, man. Yeah. Y'all know what's going on. Come on wait, wait. Are you rolling it? I'm rolling it. You're rolling it? I lost address. What are you wearing? Spend the office. Start the shoes. Go up. What's the shoes? 
Fit check, man. Shoes, man. Air Force Ones, man. Can't go wrong with the Air, Air Force, Force One. Ones. Okay, easy. Hey, what kind of socks you wear when you got to put some socks on? Socks, man. Ankle socks, man. Okay, easy. What's the Ankle pants? Socks, man. Pants. SODMG pants, man. You know what I'm saying? We had, we had SODMG. Pants. What does that stand for? Stacks on deck money game. Man. Okay, we, and, we, and with the chain. Hey, you want to try the jewelry? I see the jewels. I see, I see the watch. I see the this, the that. Man, 100K on my neck, man. Okay. Bust down Cartier, man. You know what I'm saying? Got to keep the crosses on the Infinity Links, man. Okay, go go ahead, Craig. Hey, who's the go-to jeweler? Go-to jeweler, man. Shout out Ice Brothers. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Eliante. Okay, Eliante. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to forget nobody. Who else we rock with? Uh, shout know, out brother. Jimmy out of Vegas, too. Okay, okay. What's the jacket? Jimmy the Jewel. Jacket for uh, Pure Atlanta, man. We just got back from Atlanta, man. Shout out Pure, man. Shout out to Atlanta. Pull the hat, too. Yeah, man. Hat SODMG, man. Okay, okay. Hey, what's up with bro right here? I, I see him pulling up. What you got on, bro? Yeah, bro I'm just all <laughs> black. I'm just my man. I'm all just black. Here. Easy. Hey, when you got to put the black tee on, what's the preferred black tee? You got to go on um, polo, man. Polo. Lauren, polo, man. polo, polo. Okay, yeah. and then at the end, what I always ask, you can fuck around with the question, let the people know, what you do for a living to buy clothes? What I do for I sell clothes to buy clothes. Hey, pop up. We all Melrose. Appreciate you. Thank you, man. Love. Easy. Beautiful. Big check. Hell yeah. Well, I've been trying to get that video for like a year or two. You got Appreciate it, man. Make sure you tag me. I'm going to repost it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Y'all have a good one. Love. Appreciate you, bro. Yeah. Easy. At first, I thought he was going to say no. Understand. I don't think he understood. I was like, I was all over the place. Okay, we got it though. You really be out here scouting, not gonna lie. Yeah. And Look. I feel like anytime I like. Oh, Come on, love. Let's go. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, this is this is the most LA shit that could have happened right now. Not gonna lie. Look, and you know what's crazy? That you kind of you have that fit checker intuition because we were gonna go to the Grove, and then you're like, wait, let's go to Wasteland, and something led us right here. Yeah, it's like every moment just lines up perfectly. S O D M G, you know what the? F I feel like at first I, I didn't have a lot of energy in the fit check, but then at the end it came back no, out. No, you were good. You started strong too, honestly. Hello. Hello. Yeah. You know what I think your your aesthetic is? You give like tennis core. Oh, you know what? This dummy stain. It's so stained. It's thirty eight dollars. Oh no. no, that's the skirt. <laughs> I'm like, babe, if it's thirty eight dollars, just. Color that whole green. Dying. Nah, it got, it got four tags on it. That's how you know it's gonna be pricey. So now this is my question. Do things like this happen to me because the great oh energy God. I put on to the world? I fucking love his store. What, the smell that came from that store? From, what is it? Ty, Ty Stefano, yeah. yeah. Okay, look, so this has happened because of the good energy I put on to the world and I'm just always happy and, and give rainbows and hugs and kisses. Or is it- Are you giving kisses to or, <laughs> like, like I just wonder, why do things like this happen to me? Like, I feel like me, of course, is like I'm running into Soldier Boy on the street, you know? Is it a problem I have that I always want to go to 2nd Street every single day? No, because it's such a mixed bag. Like, yeah, what did you guys get in there yesterday that I didn't see? Yeah. It's we like, both have this issue. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm glad that you have the same issues as me that you want to go to 2nd Street. Y'all look cool kicks. Should I go inside? It's all love. It's all love. It's all no, it's all love, love and it's peace. All it's love. all love for sure. Man, the cool, the, the sneaker heads are coming for me, and I'm like, I can't have an opinion. Bro, the, the sneaker heads are not liking. We were here probably like ten hours ago, but there's always always new <laughs> stuff that comes out, bro. Like if a new pair of Jeremy Scotts came out, yeah. and I'm not the first one to grab them, it's an issue. Jeremy Scott shirt. Too bad it's whooped. I like to come like every day just to see if there's like new stuff that comes out. But this is the same stuff that was yesterday. What do you mean they don't restock the whole store in a day? Bro, I feel like I have the most mid going to get coffee fit. And of course, it's the day we run into Soldier Boy and I have to get a video. It's about to be seen by a million people, bro. Yo, everything I got on is avant-garde. I right, Los Angeles, what you wearing today, bro? Everything I got on is avant-garde, man. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, let's start from the bottom up. What you got on the feet? I feel like people thought that that was a brand. Avant-garde? Like a style. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, that's why people I remember that. when uh, Nate Nate taught me Anything. what avant garde meant. Oh, that's so cute. Nate taught me what avant garde meant. Shout out to Nate, my old roommate. And I forgot we were going out one day, and I was like, "What are you wearing, bro?" He's like, "Oh, I'm wearing some avant garde today." And I was like, Who's "Like, that? I was like, what's avant garde, bro? Is that like a type of spaghetti or what?" And he's like, "You don't know what avant garde is?" And I'm like, "Bro, no. Put me on, twin." And then he told me, and then I did that video like pretty couple months after. 
And you knew you weren't out the loop. Yeah, I, I wasn't out the loop. Thank God. Can I tell you something? Yeah, tell me something. What you gotta tell me? Can it be on camera? Yeah, it can be on camera. Capris look so shitty on me, so I hate Capris. But I'm not saying anybody else can't rock them. They look really bad on me. But you're short, so like, shouldn't they fit you like regular pants? Dramatic boom. So let me show you guys really how how it goes down through like our days and stuff. Came out here by accident, went shopping a bit. There was really nothing much, so I didn't get to buy a lot of stuff. And now it's just literally sitting down in the car, top down vibes, music, air, just editing videos. I gotta get a video up already. It's already 12:27. I've really been lacking on it. Usually I like to post like at 9 a.m. LA time, but I was like, oh, we gotta go to the dentist. You know, let's go get some food, this and that. And these little TikToks that I post, if you've seen me from like my TikToks, my Instagram. They take me like an hour to two hours each to edit a one minute video. So I just gotta post up, edit anywhere I can. Like right now, in the car, editing, yada, yada, yada. So there's good and bad with waking up early and leaving the house. The good is that I feel like we got a lot of productive things done today, you know? Got the Soldier Boy fit check. I had some fire breakfast, this and that. What, what are you doing? I'm editing. I almost accidentally uploaded the wrong version of a video but I caught it right in time. So I'm getting just this final thing done and then I'm taking a nap. Yeah, the, the, the bad is that I really, really want a nap, bro. Like it's like three, two, four, four and I'm done. It's 440. I'm it's done for the five. day. I'm done for the I day. need to go take a nap, but I also want to edit this video and get it up like by six. So that's what I'm gonna do. Love y'all. Catch y'all tomorrow. Bye.